Hi, welcome back. Today we are going to create our very own artesian spring. And this is really simple. You're just going to need a water bottle. And we've colored ours with food coloring just so it's easier to see. You're going to need some more water to pour in after some of the water leaves. A container to catch all your water. And a push pen. All right, so let's get started. We're going to put one hole into our water bottle using our push pin. All right, we have pushed the push pin into our bottle. So we're going to create our hypothesis. What do you think is going to happen when I remove the push pin? What will happen when I put another hole farther down into the bottle? What do you think will happen when I take the cap off? So you can record your hypothesis on a piece of paper and we're going to see if we prove or disprove your hypothesis. So we have removed the push pen and you can see it, nothing is happening. So what if I squeeze? All right, what will happen now when I take the top off? All right, and we're gonna put the cap back on now. There we go. And that stops the spring. All right, what if we put our second hole farther down? And start to see a little bit is coming out. And that's because there's air coming in at our top spring that's causing a little bit of pressure to form down here. All right, let's take our cap off and see what happens. Now, both springs are flowing. back on. That stops our flow. Take the cap off. We're going to pour some more water on the top. Did we prove or disprove your hypothesis correct? Thank you for watching how to create your very own artesian springs at home and join us next time for more fun videos.